I grew up in North Carolina. Um, we had a horse farm outside of Charlotte. For real? Mm-hmm. A horse farm? Mm-hmm. That sounds completely crazy. I'm a city boy. I had no idea horses grew on trees. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> a ranch. We raise quarter horses. Nice. Uh-huh. You miss it? I do. It's beautiful there. And I miss my sister. And I miss my dad. I was supposed to go to Chapel Hill. Everybody in my family went to Chapel Hill. So, needless to say, they weren't too thrilled when I decided to go to ASU. I don't know, I just, I needed to do something for myself, you know? <sighs> what about you, Benny Silman? No, 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 Silman's not my name. That's just an alias. I'm a Rockefeller. Oh, right. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you ready to get to work? To work. Oh, yeah, no, no, this is a working date. That's right. Let's begin. Who wrote the theory of economic behavior? You gotta be kidding me, right? No. Nope. <laughs> Come on now. You need help with this. Okay. Um, the theory of economic behavior. Bond. Bon. Do it, Von Newman. That's it. Yes. That's perfect. <laughs> Very good. You're a small cookie. like to eat you up. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, I'm going to try harder. I'm going to try to stump you now. Ooh. Explain economic parity. Ooh. Ooh. Um. Supply and demand are equal? Close. Awfully close. <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> Here, let's try another one. OK. Who said homework isn't romantic? Me. Bingo. So Callie and I started dating, and it was great. Everything was going my way, as long as the